Hello, welcome. In this video, I will show you how fuel over repairs is working in S-Hard Analytics. And in this video, I will use the procurement overview. So I launched this application. Initially, parameter values are expected to be set. And now, euro is proposed for display color view. This is because in this default values menu, euro has been set as a default value for this particular view. This kind of personalization is possible in fuel launchpad. And by pushing go button, I can get the data. In the overview page, I can understand the overall state of my business. And uh, overview page consists of many cards. And uh, from each card, I can launch another fuel application to analyze my business in detail. By clicking the header of the card, new fuel launch application is launched. Now, generic tool the application is launched, but I go back to the original application now. In this screen, I can move the card like this. And I can also change the size of the card. And uh, it's also possible to hide or show some card. Now two cards are removed from the initial screen. This kind of personalization is possible in overview page. And I can hide the filter bar. And now I change the display currency to USD. Now the currency and the card this card is Euro, but after retrieving the data, the currency had changed to US dollar. And uh, now in this scale, data is aggregated by supplier, but I can change it to material group. This kind of local operation is possible. And uh, it's possible to customize the filter bar. Now I remove some fields and add a company called field in the filter bar. So now in the filter bar, some fields are removed, but company called field is included instead. And I enter the value in company called field and get the data. And uh, I can save the current state of filter bar customize the filter bar and the value set in the field as a variant. And I save the current state as variant V1 and set this variant as the fourth variant. And now I set the filter value in supplier field and remove the value from a company called field. And uh, I save it as a second variant V2. The variant can be shared among colleagues or uh, it is also possible to use it privately. By checking it, this variant is treated publicly so others can use it. And uh, 
In Manage menu, I can change the setting of the variant. And now I set this variant V2 to be applied automatically. So when this variant is selected, data is retrieved automatically. And uh, I go back to Fuel Launchpad and launch Procurement Overview application again. Now the variant V1 has already been applied, so the filter bar has already been customized and uh, values have been set. And uh, I'm getting the data. And uh, I select the second variant V2 and uh, it is applied automatically. That all. Thanks for watching.